So I just did a video on how to show you how to get S off on your HTC One M8, which is basically security off on the bootloader, which allows you to flash a bunch of different things like custom ROMs and uh, custom kernels and stuff like that. But one of the cool things that it does allow you to do is to take the audio enhancements from the Harmon and Cardin version of the HTC One M8 and put them on your HTC One M8. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. Okay, before you begin, you must be rooted. Uh, if you're not, click on this link here underneath the video on our site. Uh, to be taken to that video, complete it, and when you're done, come back to here to continue. You also need to have S off, which is security off on your bootloader of your HC1 M8. So if you don't, uh, because that original procedure here doesn't do that for you, but once you're done that one, you can then do this one. Uh, so you're gonna have to go to that, finish that, and then you can return here again to continue. On the device, you're gonna pull down the notification, go to settings, Go to Battery Manager, scroll all the way down, and make sure that Fast Boot is off. Also on your device, you need to make sure that you go to Settings, About, Software Information, More, and you'll see Build Number should be 1.5 something. If it's 1.1, uh, it means you're not on the latest version of the software for your device, and you need to be because otherwise it doesn't have the Harman and Carmen stuff built in. So either update naturally, um, or flash a custom ROM that is based on that build number before you continue. Then you can open your browser window and on your phone and you're going to type in bit.ly slash the number one lowercase i uppercase t lowercase c seven lowercase tv and we're using that just to shorten the full link so it's easier for you to type in. I'll take you to a thread on XDA you are going to scroll down and it says here, if you are S off, grab. And then there's this HK enable, it might even be up here at the top. No, he moved it. Okay, so it's down here. So tap that, the dot zip, uh, and then use whatever you want to download it. And wait for that to download. Turn off the device. Turn it back on by holding down volume down and power at the same time. So you get to this screen then push volume down and then power to select and choose recovery. Tap backup because we want to make sure that we do a backup before we try to do anything here. Swipe to backup and it'll begin backing up your device. Tap install and you should see the um, HK enable and update zip. Tap that and swipe to flash it. When it's done and says successful, we can just reboot system and wait for it to reboot. After it reboots, you'll go to settings and you should now have Harman Kardon Audio, which you can tap and play with the different settings there. And there you go, you now have the audio enhancements from Harman and Kardon. Um, feel free to reach out to me on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, here in the YouTube comments or on the website in the comments and let me know what you guys think. Is there really a big difference? Like, does anyone really notice a difference? Is it worth it? Um, other than that, Subscribe to the YouTube channel, um, follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. And as always, thank you for watching.